man? Three of them. Same hoodie. Oh, yeah, for sure. Yeah. Yeah. Should have brought mine, bro. What's up, G? Good, man. Good. Just had some soul food. Where at? Russell's chicken and waffles. Oh, okay. Which one y'all went to? Yeah, the one in uh, Hollywood. Okay. So, you guys good. want good photos? Get them with free, bro. Oh, you're free. Get your videos right. Yeah, it, man. Yeah, I went shopping, bro. Got some uh, some shoes, too. With the cool kids. Uh, like cool quicks too as well, but like they didn't have my size. Oh, so you want to some designer shit too? Yeah, I didn't want these anyway, but I wanted the Nikes, but hey. Yeah, it know what happens, bro. Happens. What's up, Farid? You good, bro? Chilling, chilling. All right, so we uh, in the 80. studio right now, yes, bro. Yes, we are. Myron, if I lay some bars down. Yeah, lay some bars, bro. Me? Lay some bars, other than a dating right. advice. Uh, let's see here. Nigga, do a uh, dating advice, uh, like <laughs> over a beat, you know what I <laughs> mean? There you go. That'd be some new shit. That'd be lit. That's all right, good. Yeah. So. No, I'm gonna say so y'all got the beat and everything already? Yeah, yeah, yeah. you got the beat. Wait, right. you gonna send it to you? Yeah, you can email it to me. Yo, yeah. plug your stuff, bro. Plug your stuff. Oh, my name's the Deer. How you doing? I, mm -hmm. Actually, my Instagram and everything out? Everything. Yeah, everything. Oh, hey, hell yeah. U A C N A D I R on the gram. Go tap in. My new song, Golden Child, just came out. Jeez. I'm trying, you know what I'm saying? Run the streams over there. You know what I'm saying? Trying to get famous. You know what I'm saying? Trying to blow up everything. You, know you got to, bro. From the Bay, you know what I'm saying? Out in LA. You know what I'm saying? All right, go follow him and go support him. Yeah, you already know. And this is, is it your studio? Uh, Yeah, I work here. Uh, it, I work for AD. Oh, this is 80 Smith? Yeah, this is eight, like 80 Studio. Oh, oh shit. Like okay. This yeah. is dope. Oh, I didn't even know that. We, we got two rooms. The other room's like over there. It's like a. This is kind of fire. Use, man. That's annoying, man. It's, oh, it's, right. it's a Newman. It's a Newman, yeah. Newman, yeah. yeah. I libs verse everything. Yeah. Player, man. Yeah, I've been doing shit a long time and um I made my own way of doing it. Like I said, that's why it comes out so easy because if you listen, I'm saying real shit for the most part. So yeah. it's just real easy and I, I mastered that part. And I still need help on other shit, but you know, that's what I've done. And you did a good job too for your first time in there, bro. Thanks, Not only bro. like the writing, but you know, I'm taking taking that direction. Cause that's the difficult part. When you're in the booth and everybody's out there, that shit yeah. be like, man, I'm fucking up what they're thinking. But yeah. you came here and held that shit. You got in and out quick too. Good job. Thanks, bro. Appreciate yeah, for it. Sure. Man, real talk, man. This song's gonna be, gonna be a banger. Honestly, man, music video coming soon as well. It's gonna be crazy. I buy you, man. Yep. There you go. There you go. Damn, that's just fire. <laughs> yeah. That's just fire, bro. Yo, I'm up next, bro. I'm like, god damn, bro. <laughs> this is all new to me. This nigga's a pro. Okay, real talk, man. I, I, okay, so I got a verse here already, written down. Yeah. Uh, just that I gotta go on the beat now. I should do it in the studio. So let's see how it sounds. But yo, Mr. Organic killed it though. Like real talk, he killed this shit. Give me a fire out of song, guys. Check it out. You got it. You got it. Yeah, bro. Oh man, dude. <laughs> He did that like nothing. I'm a high value man. man. AP 100 bands. Yeah. I started driving in the van. Yeah. I'm a clearing more than a oh, man. Oh, yeah, a nigga, I'm a private nigga. You see the logo. Chain looking like frog though. I'm talking about like Frozone. Superhero with the swag. Superhero with the bag. I'm living lab. You could never be the three. You could never see me, nigga, in 3D. Uh, I'm that nigga that you heard about. I know you won't be bitch, but you. Oh, right, 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 right. I gotta catch the vibe. Hold on. Yo. You hear that? Sorry. That's straight on freestyle. Bro! You wanna was, hear it though? What the fuck? Was, <laughs> Yo, you heard that shit? Yeah. That is they get lift, man. A hundred thousand on one Bitcoin, nigga. I'm living large. Yeah, credit score is doing so damn good, bitch. I'm on the guard. Yeah, I told that bitch you can't never get nothing, bitch, but a long dick. Whoa, you wanna take a big trip? Told the bitch so on the big dick. Yeah, <laughs> private jet everywhere I go. I'm a private nigga, you see the logo. Chain looking like Frosto. I'm talking about like Frozone. Superhero with the swag, superhero with the bag. I'm living lab. You could never be the three. You could never see me, nigga. In 3D. Uh, I'm that nigga that you heard about. I know you won't be bitch, but you. Nah, bring back, bring back. That I'm shit was wrong. I'm about to say the beginning part. You could show. I just start clean it up. Yep, I just clean it up down the way. Sheesh. Where I go, I'm a private nigga, you see the logo Team looking like Frosto I'm talking about like Frozone Superhero with the swag, superhero with the bag I'm living lab, you could never be the three You could never see me, nigga, in 3D uh, I'm that nigga that you heard about Rip viral nigga in a large amount Every time I walk in the room They talking about nigga, see his bank account Zero on Alright man, so yeah. I with my boy, right? 
he's putting me on a game about beats and yeah. the music industry, right? So, brother, tell me this. When you get, like, a sample, right? Yeah. How does that work with, with a beat? I know uh, Drake does it. Uh, Nicki Minaj, they all do yeah. these like, samples. How Sam- does that work? Sampling is weird because, like, a lot of the time, like, samples are usually owned by somebody. So, like, mm-hmm. you can have a sample and then, so say, like, you sample me. Mm-hmm. If you don't get the clearance from me to use my sample, you going to owe me a check. Damn. you going to owe me a fact check. And then sometimes it gets even crazier. Like, I remember uh, Soldier Boy got a check from Willow Smith because of the fact she said, wake up in the morning, turn my swag on, the first line of her song, and the whip my hair back and forth. Soldier Boy got a check from that because Damn. she said, turn my swag on. And that's Soldier Boy's song. Wow. How about the bed, turn my swag on. So she repeated the same thing, and then, boom, ran him a check. Uh, Juice World, that Lucid Dream song, mm. he had to give Sting, like, pretty much all like all the money from that song sting got the money because of the fact the beat is literally the uh i can't remember what song it is but it's something from sting from hella long ago and it's not even like a sample it's not even a direct sample they, they played the same notes and everything and like it, it got counted as like a sample like that that's crazy all, all money. what about uh, like uh, i want to say leasing beats like kind of like what you did with that song oh yeah leasing beats is tricky because like you don't own it fully so you can't really like fully you know what I'm saying? Move around with it. So, like, most people, they go on YouTube and they see, like, the beat says free and everything. And they think, like, all right, cool, this beat's free. Like, I can just download it and, like, put it on, you know what I'm saying? Apple Music and everything. A lot of times, like, uh, it's a lot of protection against producers nowadays to where, like, they can, like, you feel me, basically get your beat, your song taken down if they use, if you use their beat and don't pay for it. Damn. So they can get your song, like, taken off of all platforms and you won't even be able to, like, you feel me, use the like use the song no more that shit's gonna get taken down so that's why you gotta like pay for the uh, lease or whatever so that way that doesn't happen but then if you pay for the lease like while I was telling you what happened with me uh, sometimes it, you can't even do certain shit with your song so like if somebody comes and is like oh, I wanna put your song in a movie I wanna put your song in a TV show I wanna put your song in a video game yeah. they can't even do it because you don't own it you know what I'm saying so that's why you gotta try to like either pay for the lease and then leverage to get the exclusive rights sometime down the road when you pay for the lease or pay for the lease on that song and then hope you just get big enough with that song so you meet somebody that likes you enough and they can remake the beat for you mm-hmm. and make a beat that sounds just as fire and then redrop it because uh because all the time if you ever peep at some movies mm-hmm. in certain movies sometimes you'll hear a song like damn that song hella familiar but why the beat sound like that because the producer didn't give clearance for the beat or they couldn't get sample clearance for the beat you know what i'm saying so they had to switch the beat a little bit so that right. way they can get clearance for the movie Wow. So, so it's like, say somebody came to me and I was like, all right, cool. You can't use the beat, but like, we just like your vocals. Can we put the vocals in the movie still? I can give them the vocals and boom, I'm getting my check because, you know what I'm saying? This is my vocals. It's not, you know what I'm saying? It's Damn. not his beat. Yeah, but, there's so much politics behind that, bro. Yeah. It's, but it's crazy, though, still because of the fact that he's still going to get credited because of the fact that it's my song on his beat. You feel what I'm saying? So he can still, he's still going to get a credit as a producer even if they just play my song like if they just play the vocals because i'm performing my song which he was a producer of, you know what i'm saying and that's how it's registered wow so it's, it's really it's, it's hella confusing yeah there's so much politics behind music oh. bro music, music and beats man like she just a lot we just made our first song man shout out to mr organic man fire ass song so shout out to ronnie J for the beat and real talk man song's gonna be a banger what do you think about the song the song hard Hard. I ain't gonna lie, Mr. Organic, he's fast. I was Yo, like, his damn. flow, man, is insane. I ain't gonna lie, he went to the booth, man. I was like, God damn it, I can I can't go that hard, but I still, you know, I still did my thing for the first time. Okay, for the first time, how did I do? First time in the booth, yeah, nine out of ten, easy, nine, out of 10. nine out of 10. you get it, you get an A in my book, easily. Thanks, bro. That's an easy. Bro, I ain't gonna lie, I was like, you know what, I'm here right now, gotta do it. But I was kind of nervous a little bit, overcame that shit, did it, and the song is about to drop. Just wait for 80's verse now? You got your verse done in like 30 minutes. Most people come in here, bro. I kid you not. They be recording for so long. Damn. Can't get nothing done. That's wild. All right, guys. See you in a bit. Stay humble. Stay fresh. Comment down below. What do you think about the song? Are you ready for it to drop? Let me know. See you guys in a bit. Peace.